Hi guys, Rusty here. Well, yeah, I feel like it's been a while since I made a video. <laughs> but, uh, so this one we're going to do a mail call because I had a couple awesome people that, that sent me some swag and, uh, yeah, I, I figured I need to share it with y'all and, and, uh, let y'all see some of it. So the first one I got in was, uh, from Harley Girl. Me and her are swapping stickers. She has her business card here, spam card. It tells about all her, her sites and stuff and her toy hauling and, uh, and, and her trips and stuff really need to check her out she has got some cool content for sure and she's up there in Canada and her sticker and uh let's see another sticker here and I got a poker chip from her local dealership which is Rocky Rocky's Harley Davidson yeah let's see if we get that focus there we go backside awesome man love the moose and a uh, little odd fact about rusty um, even though I'm a southern boy and I've lived in the south most of my life um, in the 70s uh, my family and I we all moved up to Alaska and lived up there for two years my dad actually lived up there for four years but uh, he worked the pipeline so when uh, we were out there uh, I was very young, obviously, and <laughs> that was actually some of my first memories of home. I really thought I was from up there, and then when we moved back, it was a fairly big culture shock to come down into the southern heat like like it was, because it was, it was 1977 when we came back, and that was one of the record years for one of the hottest summers I think we had, and man, I tell you, that was, that was uh, some adjustment again. Um, the second person that I got swag from was uh, Brian Ford and uh, Brian says well I don't have custom stickers so he went out to his local dealership and spent his time to go out of his way and and uh, he got me some Harley stickers which are badass uh, um, the old number one I love it that's I've actually got a t-shirt with that on there and uh, my derby cover on my bike for my air cleaner has that and then uh, Quaid Harley Davidson, I think it's pronounced Quaid. But was the dealership? Yeah, man, that's awesome. Two poker chips. Oop, about dropped it. Yep. Oh, did I get that? That's Riverside. Or is it Rivers? Yeah, Riverside Harley Davidson. Yeah, so he's went to two dealerships and got me two different poker chips, local to him. Awesome man, I do appreciate that greatly. And uh, I have been struggling to figure out where I'm gonna put these uh, uh, all these chips and stickers and stuff, and and where I can display them and and not be missing them if I paint or do something, you know. So. I was watching Mr. McStash's videos, and he does a really cool thing, and, and I'm going to adopt that. I actually have ordered the stuff, but it's uh, sheet magnets, and uh, I'm going to take, sorry about the thumb there, <laughs> but I'm going to take those sheet magnets and cut them out in the shape of the stickers, I'm going to stick the stickers to them, and then I can magnetically attach them to my toolbox or, or whatever else I want to attach them to, and if I want to move them and say put them on a say I get a garage refrigerator or something I can display them on my refrigerator or around my motorcycle lift they can go all kinds of places and they're, they're movable so I'll never lose them and that, that means a lot to me because y'all took the time and effort to send them to me and I wouldn't want them to become gone if I got rid of a toolbox or like I said painted a wall or something so to me that's gonna be awesome just to do that and be able to know that if I move or anything that I can take them with me so that's what's in the works for me and uh, that's what I plan to do and uh, shout out to Mr. McStash for an awesome idea man I really did not think about that until I was watching his videos and and uh, it's fairly inexpensive actually you order them from Amazon so good on you man and uh, if you're new to the channel 
hit the like and subscribe button hit that notification bell so you can see these videos and we'll holler at y'all later